Today, I want to talk to you about something truly magical, manifestation. But before we dive into the signs that you're on the right path for manifestation, let's take a moment to center ourselves and connect with the divine love that surrounds us. Now, the first sign that you're on the right path for manifestation is feeling a sense of alignment and flow. When you're aligned with your true self and the universe, everything seems to fall into place effortlessly. You feel a deep sense of peace, joy, and purpose permeating every aspect of your being. Now let's talk about the second sign, which is experiencing healing. Healing is when you start to feel better after being hurt or going through a tough time. It can happen in different ways. Maybe your body gets better if you were sick, or you start to feel happier after feeling sad for a long time. Healing can happen in many forms. It can be physical, emotional, or spiritual. Physical healing is when your body gets better from being sick or hurt. Emotional healing is when you start to feel better after going through something that made you sad or upset. And spiritual healing is when you feel more connected to yourself and the world around you. You might not even realize that you're healing at first. Maybe you start to notice that you're feeling happier or more at peace. Or maybe you notice that your body doesn't hurt as much as it used to. These are all signs that healing is happening in your life. Healing is a good thing. It means that you're letting go of old hurts and making space for new good things to come into your life. It's like cleaning out your closet. You get rid of the old stuff you don't need anymore and you make room for new stuff that makes you happy. Sometimes healing can be hard. It can bring up old feelings or memories that you'd rather forget. But it's important to let yourself feel those feelings and work through them. That's how you heal and move forward. Now let's talk about the third sign, which is embracing self-love. Loving yourself is really important. It means being kind to yourself and treating yourself well. When you love yourself, you feel good about who you are, and that's a wonderful feeling to have. Loving yourself unconditionally means accepting yourself just the way you are, flaws and all. It's about being gentle with yourself and forgiving yourself when you make mistakes. When you love yourself, you become your own best friend, and that's pretty special. One of the amazing things about self-love is that it attracts more love into your life. When you feel good about yourself, you send out positive vibes and other people are drawn to you. You become like a magnet for good things like happiness, success, and friendship. So, how can you practice self-love? Well, one way is to take a moment each day to appreciate yourself. Think about all the things you like about yourself, like your talents, your sense of humor, or your kindness. Take a moment to thank yourself for being you. Another way to practice self-love is to treat yourself well. That means taking care of your body by eating healthy foods, getting enough sleep, and exercising regularly. It also means doing things that make you happy, like spending time with friends, pursuing your hobbies, or taking a bubble bath. Now let's talk about the fourth sign, which is overcoming fear. Fear is something we all feel sometimes. It's a natural reaction to things that seem scary or unknown. But the good news is, fear doesn't have to stop you from doing what you want to do or being who you want to be. The first step in overcoming fear is to recognize that it's okay to feel afraid. It's a normal part of being human, and everyone experiences it at some point. Instead of letting fear control you, try to understand where it's coming from and why you're feeling it. Sometimes, just acknowledging your fear can help you feel more in control. Next, it's essential to trust in yourself and in the universe. Believe that you have the strength and courage to face your fears head on. Know that you are capable of handling whatever challenges come your way. Trust that the universe is always supporting you and guiding you towards your highest good. One powerful way to overcome fear is to choose love over fear. 
Instead of letting fear dictate your actions, choose to act from a place of love and compassion. Focus on what you want to achieve and the positive outcomes you hope to create. When you approach life with love instead of fear, you empower yourself to overcome any obstacles that come your way. Now let's explore the fifth sign, which is embracing positive affirmations. Affirmations are like little magic spells that you can use to change your life for the better. They're simple phrases that you repeat to yourself like I am strong or I am worthy that can help you reprogram your mind and attract what you want into your life. When you say affirmations, you're sending a powerful message to your subconscious mind. Instead of focusing on what you don't want, you're focusing on what you do want, which helps you shift your mindset and attract positive outcomes. It's essential to take some time each day to affirm what you want to manifest in your life. Find a quiet place where you won't be disturbed and take a few deep breaths to center yourself. Then repeat your affirmations out loud or in your mind, focusing on each word and feeling its truth resonating within you. Choose affirmations that feel right to you and align with your deepest desires. They can be about anything you want to manifest, whether it's success, love, health, or happiness. The key is to make sure they're positive, empowering, and in the present tense as if they're already true. Now let's explore the sixth sign, which is feeling grateful. Gratitude is like a magical key that unlocks the door to abundance in your life. When you feel thankful for the things you already have, you create a welcoming space for even more blessings to flow into your life. Every day, it's essential to take a moment to reflect on all the good things that surround you. It could be something as simple as the warmth of the sun on your face, the smile of a loved one, or a delicious meal on your table. By acknowledging and appreciating these blessings, you're inviting more positivity and abundance into your life. Expressing gratitude is like sending out a signal to the universe, letting it know that you're open and receptive to receiving more goodness. It's a powerful way of affirming that you already have everything you need to lead a fulfilling life. So make it a daily habit to count your blessings and express gratitude for them. You can do this through journaling, prayer, or simply taking a moment of quiet reflection. As you cultivate an attitude of gratitude, you'll find that your perspective shifts and you become more aware of the abundance that surrounds you. And lastly, we come to the seventh sign, trusting the universe. This means believing that there is a grand plan for you, crafted by the universe itself. It's about having faith that everything is happening exactly as it's meant to, even if it doesn't always seem clear to you. Trusting the universe involves releasing the urge to micromanage every aspect of your life. Instead, it's about surrendering to the natural rhythm and flow of life. Picture yourself as a leaf floating down a gentle stream, allowing the current to guide you effortlessly. Even when things appear chaotic or uncertain, trust that the universe is orchestrating events in your favor. Sometimes challenges arise to lead us toward greater growth and understanding. It's about recognizing that every twist and turn in the journey of life serves a purpose, even if it's not immediately apparent. So there you have it seven signs that you're on the right path for manifestation. Keep an eye out for these signs in your life and remember to always trust in the power of the universe to manifest your dreams. Thank you for watching and until next time, keep manifesting miracles in your life. We become. It's a simple yet profound truth that many overlook. Let's take a moment to use our imagination. Picture yourself holding a magical key, not just any key, but the key to your own destiny. With this key in your hand, 
You have the power to shape your life in any way you choose. Now, think about your thoughts and beliefs as if they were paintbrushes. Every time you have a thought, it's like dipping that brush into a palette of colors and painting a stroke onto the canvas of your life. Each belief you hold adds another layer to the masterpiece that is your existence. But here's the thing. You get to decide what kind of painting you want to create. You can choose to fill your canvas with bright, vibrant colors that reflect your hopes, dreams, and aspirations. Or you can opt for darker, more somber hues that reflect fear, doubt, and negativity. The beauty of it all is that you are the artist of your own life. You have the power to choose which colors to use, which brush strokes to make, and how to bring your vision to life. It's a blank canvas waiting to be filled with the masterpiece that is uniquely yours. But with great power comes great responsibility. You see, every stroke you make, every color you choose, has an impact on the final outcome. If you constantly dwell on negative thoughts and beliefs, you'll find yourself painting a picture of despair and disappointment. On the other hand, if you focus on positivity and possibility, your canvas will be filled with scenes of joy, abundance, and fulfillment. It's all about where you choose to direct your attention and energy. You might be wondering, how can I make my thoughts more positive? How can I change the way I see the world? Well, let me tell you, my friend, it's all about being aware of what's going on inside your mind. Think of it like this. Your mind is like a garden and your thoughts are the seeds you plant. If you're not paying attention, those seeds can grow into weeds that choke out the beauty and joy in your life. But if you take the time to tend to your garden, to nurture it with love and care, you can cultivate a paradise of positivity and abundance. So, the first step is to become aware of the stories you tell yourself. Pay attention to the thoughts that flit through your mind like butterflies. Are they uplifting and empowering, or do they drag you down into a pit of negativity and self-doubt? Once you've identified the stories that are holding you back, it's time to rewrite them. Replace those old, worn-out narratives with new ones that lift you up and inspire you to greatness. Instead of saying, I can't do this, try saying, I am capable and resourceful. I can overcome any challenge that comes my way. It's all about reframing your perspective, seeing yourself and your life in a new light. Instead of focusing on what's wrong, focus on what's right. Instead of dwelling on past mistakes, focus on the lessons they taught you and how you can grow from them. But awareness isn't just about noticing your thoughts, it's also about paying attention to the world around you. How do you perceive the people and situations in your life? Are you seeing them through a lens of fear and judgment, or are you approaching them with love and compassion? Let's take a little break from the hustle and bustle of life and really think about things. Pause for a moment and look within yourself. What beliefs have you been carrying around that maybe aren't helping you anymore? You know, those ideas that make you feel small or afraid, the ones that hold you back from reaching your full potential. Think about it like this. Imagine you're carrying a heavy backpack full of rocks. Each rock represents a belief that weighs you down, making it hard to move forward. Now, some of those rocks might be useful, they keep you grounded and safe, but others, well, they're just dead weight, holding you back from soaring to new heights. So ask yourself, what rocks are you ready to let go of? What beliefs no longer serve you? Maybe it's the belief that you're not good enough or that success is only for other people. Maybe it's the story you've been telling yourself about how things will never change. So why bother trying? Now I get it. Letting go of old beliefs can be scary. It's like stepping into the unknown, not knowing what lies ahead. But here's the thing. When you release those limiting beliefs, you create space for something new to take their place. 
you open yourself up to endless possibilities and opportunities for growth. So take a deep breath and trust that you are capable of rewriting your story. You have the power to break free from the patterns of limitation and fear that have been holding you back. It's all about shifting your perspective, seeing yourself and your life in a new light. Instead of focusing on what you can't do, focus on what you can. Instead of dwelling on past failures, focus on the lessons they taught you. Instead of letting fear dictate your actions, focus on the courage that lies within you, waiting to be unleashed. Affirmations are like magic spells that we cast with our words. They have the power to transform our thoughts and beliefs, shaping our reality in wondrous ways. When we repeat affirmations, we're not just saying words, we're reprogramming our minds to focus on the positive, to see the beauty and abundance that surrounds us. Imagine your mind as a garden, and affirmations are like seeds that you plant. When you nurture them with love and care, they grow into beautiful flowers that bloom with abundance and joy. By speaking words of love and gratitude, we're tending to our inner garden, cultivating a mindset of positivity and possibility. It's like flipping a switch in our minds, turning on the light of awareness, and opening ourselves up to the miracles that await us. When we focus on what we're grateful for, we attract even more blessings into our lives. It's a cycle of abundance that begins with a simple shift in perspective. Now, I know some of you may be skeptical, and that's okay, but I invite you to suspend disbelief for just a moment and open your heart to the possibility of transformation. The journey of self-discovery might feel tough at times, but it's always worth it in the end. It's like walking along a winding path. There might be bumps and obstacles, but every step brings you closer to finding your true self. And even when it feels like you're all on your own, remember this, you're never truly alone. Picture the universe as your greatest ally, always working behind the scenes to support you. It's like having a best friend who's constantly cheering you on, even when you can't see or hear them. The universe wants nothing more than to see you thrive, to see you shine brightly like a star in the night sky. So when things get tough and you start to doubt yourself, take a moment to pause and remember this truth. The universe has your back. It's conspiring in your favor, weaving its magic to guide you towards your highest good. So as we come to the end of our time together, I want to leave you with this thought. You are powerful beyond measure and the only limits that exist are the ones you place upon yourself. Message becomes, affirmations work by changing your thoughts and beliefs. If you keep saying positive things to yourself, you start to believe them. And when you believe something, it's more likely to happen. So if you want good things to come into your life, it's important to focus on positive thoughts and beliefs. For example, instead of thinking, I hope I get lucky and find a good job, you can say, I am confident and capable, and I attract opportunities for success. By repeating this affirmation to yourself, you start to believe that you're capable of finding a good job. And when you believe in yourself, you're more likely to take actions that lead to success. Affirmations are a way of programming your mind for success. They help you stay focused on what you want and keep you motivated to take action. When you keep saying positive things to yourself, you start to feel more confident and empowered. And when you feel good about yourself, you're more likely to attract good things into your life. It's important to choose affirmations that resonate with you personally. Pick statements that feel true and meaningful to you. You can also create your own affirmations based on what you want to achieve. Affirmations are like positive statements you say to yourself. They help you think in a good way. For example, when you say, I am abundant, 
you remind yourself that you have a lot of good things in your life. Saying, I am deserving of all good things, helps you believe that you deserve happiness and success. And when you say, I am open to receive blessings from the universe, you show that you're ready to accept good things into your life. Affirmations can change how you think about yourself and the world around you. If you often feel like you don't have enough or that things won't work out for you, affirmations can help you see things differently. They shift your mindset from one of not having enough to one of having plenty. When you say affirmations, you're telling your mind what you want to believe. You're planting seeds of positivity and abundance in your thoughts. Over time, these seeds grow and become stronger. They replace old beliefs of lack and limitation with new beliefs of abundance and possibility. Affirmations work by reprogramming your subconscious mind. Your subconscious is like a big computer that stores all your thoughts, feelings, and beliefs. When you repeat affirmations regularly, they sink into your subconscious and become part of your belief system. As you repeat affirmations, you start to notice changes in how you feel and act. You become more confident, optimistic, and hopeful. You start to see opportunities where you once saw obstacles, and you attract more good things into your life because you're open to receiving them. Visualization is like creating a movie in your mind. It's a powerful way to make your dreams come true. When you visualize, you close your eyes and imagine yourself in the life you want. You see yourself achieving all the things you've ever wanted. Picture yourself reaching your goals, feeling happy, and having everything you need. It's like daydreaming, but with a purpose. When you visualize, you focus your thoughts and energy on what you want to happen. You create a mental image of success and abundance. Imagine waking up in the morning and feeling excited about your day ahead. Picture yourself doing the things you love, surrounded by people who support and care about you. See yourself achieving your goals with ease and confidence. Visualize every detail of your ideal life from the way your home looks to the way you feel in your body. As you visualize, imagine the emotions you would feel if your dreams came true. Feel the joy, excitement, and gratitude as if it's already happening. Katambwamt. Yourself bask in the positive energy of your dreams coming true. Visualizing your desires helps you align your thoughts and emotions with what you want to manifest. When you visualize regularly, you send a clear message to the universe about what you want. You're telling the universe, this is what I desire, and I believe it's possible. Your thoughts and feelings create a magnetic energy that attracts similar experiences into your life. The more you focus on your dreams with positive intention, the more likely they are to become a reality. Visualization is a tool that successful people use to achieve their goals. Athletes use it to improve their performance. Artists use it to unleash their creativity, and entrepreneurs use it to attract opportunities. When you visualize, you tap into the power of your subconscious mind to create the life you want. To start visualizing, find a quiet space where you won't be interrupted. Close your eyes and take a few deep breaths to relax your body and mind. Then imagine yourself in the life of your dreams. See yourself accomplishing your goals, living with purpose, and enjoying abundance in every area of your life. The universe pays attention to what you think and want. Imagine your thoughts and intentions are like seeds you're planting in a garden. Just like you care for seeds in a garden by giving them water, sunlight, and care, you should also nurture your thoughts with love, positivity, and strong belief. When you treat your thoughts with care and positivity, they start to grow. 
Just like how seeds grow into beautiful flowers when you take good care of them, your thoughts can turn into reality when you nurture them with love and positivity. Think of your mind as a garden where you plant seeds of your desires. When you plant positive thoughts and intentions, you create a fertile ground for them to grow. But if you fill your mind with negative thoughts and doubts, it's like planting weeds that choke the growth of your desires. So it's essential to cultivate a positive mindset and believe in the power of your thoughts. When you have faith in yourself and your dreams, you're sending a clear message to the universe about what you want. Just like a gardener tends to their plants with care and attention, you should tend to your thoughts with love and positivity. Water them with affirmations, sunlight them with visualizations, and nourish them with gratitude. Now I know it can be tempting to feel discouraged when things don't happen as quickly as we'd like. But trust in the divine timing of the universe. Trust that everything is unfolding exactly as it should. You are never alone on this journey. The universe is always conspiring in your favor, supporting you every step of the way. So I encourage you to let go of the notion of luck and instead focus on the power of your own thoughts, beliefs, and intentions. Trust in the magic of the universe and know that you are always guided and supported on your journey. Chronicity, where events seem to align perfectly, you may receive unexpected blessings and opportunities, but along with these blessings, you may also encounter challenges and obstacles. This is all part of the process of growth and transformation. Embrace these challenges as opportunities for learning and expansion. During this time, it's important to stay grounded and centered. Practice affirmations daily to reaffirm your worthiness and your ability to navigate through any situation with grace and ease. As you come closer to the shift, you may find yourself releasing old patterns and beliefs that no longer serve you. This can be a challenging process, but it's necessary for your growth and evolution. Embrace this opportunity to let go of the past and step into the fullness of who you are meant to be. Trust that the universe is guiding you towards your highest good. Another great way to tap into your inner guidance is through meditation. Meditation is like taking a break for your mind. It's a special time when you can sit quietly, let go of all your worries, and just be still. During meditation, you can connect with your inner wisdom and intuition. These are the parts of you that know what's best for you and can guide you in the right direction. They're like your inner GPS, helping you navigate through life's twists and turns. To meditate, Find a quiet place where you won't be disturbed. Sit or lie down in a comfortable position, close your eyes, and take a few deep breaths to relax your body and mind. As you breathe, let go of any tension or stress you may be holding on to. Imagine all your worries melting away like snowflakes in the sun. Feel yourself becoming lighter and more peaceful with each breath you take. Once you feel relaxed, focus your attention inward. Pay attention to the sensations in your body, the thoughts in your mind, and the feelings in your heart. Notice any thoughts or emotions that arise, but don't judge them or try to push them away. Just let them come and go like clouds passing through the sky. As you continue to breathe deeply and stay present, you may start to feel a sense of calm and clarity washing over you. This is your inner wisdom and intuition speaking to you. It may come in the form of subtle insights, gut feelings, or flashes of inspiration. Most importantly, make it a habit to be thankful for the journey you're on. Each moment you experience, whether it feels good or not so good, is like a present that teaches you something important and helps you become better. Gratitude is about saying thank you for all the things you have, whether they're big or small. It's about appreciating the good things in your life and finding reasons to be thankful 
even when things don't seem to be going your way. When you practice gratitude, you shift your focus from what's missing or wrong to what's present and right. You start to notice all the blessings and opportunities that surround you, even in challenging times. Take a moment each day to think about what you're grateful for. It could be something as simple as the warmth of the sun on your face, the smile of a loved one, or the food on your table. Write down three things you're thankful for every day and you'll start to see how much goodness there is in your life. Gratitude isn't just about being thankful for the good things. It's also about finding the silver lining in difficult situations. When something doesn't go as planned or you face a setback, try to see it as an opportunity for growth and learning. Ask yourself, what can I learn from this experience? How can it help me become a better person? Even in the midst of challenges, there are always things to be grateful for. Maybe the setback taught you to be more resilient, or it brought you closer to someone who offered support and encouragement. Find the lessons and blessings in every experience, and you'll cultivate a mindset of gratitude that can transform your life. Imagine the life you want with a clear picture in your mind. Picture yourself living in a world full of good things, happiness, and feeling satisfied. Understand that this dream is something you can make real. Visualizing means creating a mental image of what you want your life to look like. Close your eyes and see yourself living in your dream home, surrounded by loved ones, doing work you love, and enjoying every moment of your life. Feel the emotions of joy, gratitude, and contentment as if it's already happening. Believe that the life you're imagining is possible for you. Trust that you have the power to turn your dreams into reality. Know that you deserve to live a life of abundance, happiness, and fulfillment. Visualizing your ideal life helps you clarify your goals and desires. When you can clearly see what you want, you're more likely to take the necessary steps to achieve it. Your vision becomes a guidepost for making decisions and taking action in alignment with your dreams. Set aside time each day to visualize your desired life. Find a quiet, comfortable space where you won't be interrupted and allow yourself to fully immerse in the experience. Use all your senses to make the visualization as vivid and real as possible. As you visualize, Focus on the positive aspects of your life and the feelings of joy and fulfillment they bring. Let go of any doubts or fears that may arise and replace them with confidence and belief in yourself. Lastly, it's time to take action that fills your heart with inspiration and purpose. Start by setting clear goals for yourself, outlining the steps you need to take to achieve them. Whether it's starting a new project, pursuing a passion, or making positive changes in your life, every action you take brings you closer to your dreams. Believe in the power of the universe to guide and support you along your journey. Trust that as you align your actions with your intentions, the universe conspires to help you succeed. Keep faith in yourself and in the divine timing of your path. Even when faced with challenges or setbacks, know that they are merely detours on your road to greatness. Stay open to receiving guidance and opportunities from unexpected sources. Sometimes, the universe speaks to us through synchronicities, chance encounters, or intuitive nudges. Pay attention to these signs and follow where they lead you. Remember, the universe has your back and it's always working in your favor. As you take inspired action, stay grounded in the present moment. Focus on what you can do right now to move closer to your goals, rather than worrying about the future or dwelling on the past. Take each step with mindfulness and intention, knowing that every small action contributes to the bigger picture of your life's journey. Be persistent and resilient in the face of challenges. Understand that setbacks are opportunities for growth and learning. Instead of giving up when things get tough, use them as fuel to propel you forward. 
trust in your own abilities and in the wisdom of the universe to guide you through any obstacles that come your way. Celebrate your progress along the way, no matter how small. Each step forward is a victory worth acknowledging. Take time to acknowledge your achievements and express gratitude for how far you've come. Cultivate a mindset of abundance and appreciation, knowing that the universe rewards those who are grateful for their blessings. So, as you come closer to the shift, embrace the changes that unfold in your life. Trust that these unfamiliar things are guiding you towards your highest good and greatest potential.